Hello, Grade 5. How are you today? Are you excited for our new lesson? Before we proceed to our new lesson, let's have first the review about conductor and insulator. Conductor allows electricity to flow. Examples, we have silver, gold, copper, steel, and sea water. While, insulator does not allow electricity to flow. Examples, we have rubber, glass, diamond, and dry woods. What do you see in the picture? Very good! That is an electric circuit. This is our topic for today. The objectives for today's lesson are Identify an electric circuit. How does an electric circuit work? Percussionary measures in making an electric circuit. What is an electric circuit? An electric circuit is a closed path that allows electricity to flow from one point to another. Parts of electric circuit Dry cell or battery It is the source of electricity. Copper wire The path where electricity to flow. Light bulb The device that uses current. Switch allows a connection to be open or close. How does electric circuit works? This is how the electric circuit works. When the switch is off, the circuit is not closed, meaning the electrical current will not flow from the batteries to the bulb. When you move the switch to the on position, the electricity from the batteries will flow to the wire, going to the bulb, making it light up. These are the precautionary measures in an electric circuit. Number 1. Switch off the bulb when not in use. Number 2. Always handle an electrical parts with dry hands. Number 3. Keep your work area clean. Number 4. Wear personal protective equipments like gloves and goggles. Number 5. Don't forget to ask for assistance or help in your father, older brother, or sister in making an electric circuit. For our generalization, an electric circuit is a closed path that allows electricity to flow from one point to another. The source of this electricity is a battery. The parts of electric circuit are the battery, copper wire, bulb, and the switch. How does an electric circuit work? When the switch is off, the electric current from the battery will not flow to the bulb. And when the switch is on position, the electricity from the batteries will flow to the wire going to the bulb making it light up. Always remember the precautions in handling an electric parts. Today's lesson teaches us to value our life, the gift of signs that electricity provides comfort to the people and affects us every single day. I hope that you enjoy and learn a lot from our topic for today. Thank you for listening. Goodbye!